soup. <sighs> iced tea. Who doesn't like a nice cup of iced tea? In the morning, because this is morning. No, I don't drink alcohol. In the morning. So, it's not alcohol. Remember, it's a kid's show. Yo, how about this Deadpool cup, man? Look at this Deadpool cup. What's up, everybody? This is not a Peter McKinnon video. This is my video, because it's lamer. And it's not as hype. Now everybody's going to think I copied Peter McKinnon, because I'm drinking tea. Peter McKinnon, you got you got them hooked on coffee. Like I don't know where people started drinking coffee, and those people that don't like coffee started drinking coffee, and people that drink coffee started drinking even more coffee. I understand, you know, Peter McKinnon's big and all, and I like him too. I'm just not gonna do what he does to get views and get views, and you know, just putting it out there, just putting it out there. You guys been wondering, what am I doing? What what are you doing, man? What what, what did you? What have you been up to? I've been up to a lot. Um, I've been doing some stuff, you know, working on myself, working on uh, projects with friends, and uh, you know, it's, it's been going all right. You know, well, COVID has us all crazy and whatnot. So, you know, this whole COVID thing kind of hit us all of us strong. So, we're getting through this, guys. We're gonna get through this. And I know what you guys are thinking. We see you wearing this hat says Adorama yeah Adorama it's not in like it's I got this at a convention it's like a fl uh, FP Flashpoint R2 I, I guess and uh, I got this at a New York convention cuz I live in New York and Adorama is like right around the corner from where I live not really but it's close yeah this is so it's not the typical video just you know just wanted to say what's up and um, you know talk about a couple stuff you know um, Yesterday, I actually worked with one of my buddies, Brandon Williams. He is CEO of Suit and Time Magic, and we were doing a trailer um, the other day, and it went really good. I really liked the trailer it came out. If you guys have not seen the trailer, it's uh, right here. Right? I filmed that. Not not no trying to brag or anything, but uh you know I did a pretty good job. I did a pretty good job. It's not bad. It was okay, you know. Uh he had a previous video that was filmed by a previous person. It was a good video, except you know, it wasn't his what he was looking for and um so he, he wanted to do it again. But uh link below under the previous video, it's on Invictus Magic. And uh, I work for Invictus and uh, Suit and Tie, you know, just here and there. Uh, if you guys didn't know, that's how I started uh, my career as a magician. Everybody's like, what? These guys completely copying Peter McKinnon. No, before I even knew Peter McKinnon, I was doing magic. So, 
I've been doing magic for how old am I? Since I was 10, that's like 11 years later, and I unfortunately stopped at the moment, but I feel like picking it up because um, reasons. That's what it is, reasons. So yeah, I'm gonna start picking it back up, and um, you know, I, I kind of want to do it again now, not as a profession anymore, but I want to do it as a hobby. And you know, it keeps me, you know, occupied learning all these slides and crazy stuff. If you guys piece seen my past videos, they have been more magic oriented. Um, but that's not to say that I'm, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm still a magician. I'm just not a full time magician anymore. I'm a part time now, and I'm a full time filmmaker, full time photographer, not full time filmmaker. I lied. I can't. I don't think I can say that because I think full time filmmaker copyrighted it. So I'm sorry. I've been busy, you know. If you guys have not checked out my Instagram, I have a couple pictures that I posted throughout this. I also took a break from there, from Instagram, like a week or so. I'm going to start back up again, you know, because cause social media can be, um, how do you say, toxic at times. And, you know, you don't, you don't want to feel toxic in an environment where everybody's supposed to feel safe. Um, so... You know, I would just say take a break every now and then from like social media, Snapchat, whatever you use. I don't use Snapchat. Uh, every now and then I post a picture there, but you know, I, I know people there. It's like I'm just people, man. People are crazy. If you're gonna say you're gonna do something, do it. You know, like I'm not gonna get mad. All you have to do is let me know because uh, there's a reason why I contacted you. I contacted. It you for a reason because i needed you or something like that or i need you to do something for me and if you could say no you could say no you know it's just straight up no but if you just you know get my hopes up and then all of a sudden just not do it i understand people go through stuff even right now people are going through stuff even right now i am going through stuff right now you know but it's, that's not to say i'm gonna tell you i'm gonna do something and not do it you know what i'm saying no shade you have to understand you know like if you're gonna say it, do it. And if you're not, then don't compromise in doing it. People you tell you to do something because they want you to do it specifically because either they like the personality or who you are or because or you're good at it. Uh, let's say worst case scenario because they, you know, they have to because they need you, you know, um, not because they like you or whatnot, but, you know, it is what it is. And I don't like that phrase, but. It literally is what it is, and I'm not upset, and people don't, you know, you guys shouldn't get upset with that person, you know, things happen, but just know that you're not going to do it, I, like, for example, I won't do it to that person, or I, I know other people won't do it to their friends, but, you know, you, you gotta, like, you gotta do what you gonna, you're going to say, like, because it's it gets annoying, and, you know, you, people start trusting you less and less. And then, you know, people tend to ask, well, why isn't this person talking to me anymore or this and that? You know, people really tend to think, oh, he's not going to talk to me. Like, right now, I'm, uh, it's not my really interest. Uh, who am I talking to? Who am I not talking to? Um, because, you know, reasons. And, you know, I don't want to get too personal here on YouTube. But, you know, I usually get personal on Instagram. That's why if you want to know more about me. Uh, a little bit more into my life um i suggest you head there because i post a lot of stuff so that was pretty much it i just want to do a quick update on uh, what i've been doing and why this channel kind of paused i know some people have given i've gotten a couple messages like hey you know i like your stuff this and that and you know, i've been getting recommendations and people get scared when they recommend me so it's like oh yeah i'm just starting out but you know i think this and this and that and i'm like i don't get mad this is a positive reinforcement this is good criticism that i can take and i can uh make this content better for you guys so what i'm saying and don't think i'm gonna take it badly i'm not gonna take it badly you know i'm just gonna i'm gonna work on it and work on myself just to make it a little bit better so you know and i really appreciate your guys's comment i really do and i want to do i want to make more content on this channel um if you have not seen it i posted like a mini like uh 
how do you say it? Like a mini video, like a short film. It's called Coffee. Um, and if you guys could check it out, like the link is down below as well. Like, I want you to guys give it like your most sincere opinion. Like, what do you guys think? Was it shot well? You know, because I, I am limited to like this was during the COVID thing, so I couldn't leave the house and then you know film over there. But it, it, it. I liked it, like, it took me two hours to film it, just to make, like, that two-minute video. Two minutes, three minutes, I believe, in a small space, so let me know what you guys think. Again, thanks to you guys for watching this video. Like, comment, subscribe, you know, hit that notification button to see when I'm uploading because, you know, it could be every 20 years or so. Also, subscribe to Suit and Tie Magic's channel and Invictus Magic, Magic Below. <laughs> Link is down below. Uh, also, my friend Gregory, he's not here at the moment, but I filmed videos with him. And um, that's pretty much it, guys. See you on the next one. Deuces.